opportunity to, to see you, just to be around you, and we know that you're going to change things. We know that you're going to make things better, and we're very thankful for that. And we ask that, you know, you have mercy on us and forgive us for the things that we do that slow us up, that make your job harder as our shape as our teacher, as our Lord. Um, but we ask that you give us what we need to not do that anymore. Give us the things that we need, that we are better, and that we can help other people be better. We're just very thankful. We're just very, very thankful. I don't even know how to say it. We're just so thankful. Um, I look forward, I'm thankful for this week and I look forward to the next week. So every week, every, things, every time things get better and better and better and better. Um, so today we have, um, we've collected $210 and today we have $140 here and the rest is from the bank account that we will bring to you. We showing a lot of love through the actions. Idea is one of the best ways. We're going to do that. Come on. We call the idea. And I'm going to go myself. And I'm going to go to my baby before I go. And I can't try my outfit. So I would really hope that you will accept what we have gathered here. And then there will be more to come. There's even more Saturday sitting in the even now. Let's come. The way I'm feeling right now, I don't have words for it. I don't think there's a word for the way that I'm feeling now. It's gone to a place where I uh, only have feelings. So I'm going to try the best I can to say my thanks. Uh, first of all, what you have done for, for me and giving me uh, the title of Universal Journey. I know it's not a title for me to just sit down. It's a title for me to work. There's a lot of work in the United States. King Beto has said himself that there will be more money here in the United States than even in Senegal. And so by that saying, you know, there's a lot of work that there is to be done here in the United States. And I hope that I'm, as you have always done, in helping me uh, to continue to work. Because I know it's only the nimble. It's only your strength. It's only your grace. It's only your mercy. It's only your taufe that, that enables us to even be here. I'm so thankful to be here you know, in the Yeso. And I'm also thankful as well to be in this, you know, working for you. Uh, the way that all of us are working together, um, working with Sona Bator, is just nothing but increase. The way that she has shown us to work is positive, with nothing but focus on you. She said Sangibi is one. It's a singular focus. It focuses on you too. And when we're working, we're working with our focus on YouTube. And we ask that you help us to keep our focus on YouTube. 
and continue to work on the path and not slow down and not get tired. Asking for your help. And I'm thanking you. It's a, it's a blessing for, for you to be here. It's a blessing for to have Sona Bator here as well. In our house, uh, there's, there's so much I could do. I couldn't be happier right now. <laughs> uh, I'm so thankful to and, and to be able to share this with my family. My wife Denar has been cooking all day. She's, she's, she, with love, I can see how she's so focused the way she's working. I'm so proud of her. So thankful. This is a wife that was given to me by Sir Benjamin. And I, I, I can do nothing but to give thanks. Something that Serene Betcho gives you, you hold on tight to it, and you do your best. And that's what I only try to do. I know I'm not perfect. I'm not the perfect husband. And I just hope that I could do better you know, for her. Because I know that she is someone that Serene Betcho has given me as a wife. And I'm thankful for that. Serene Betcho is my witness. I'm thankful for that. So I'm, I'm giving thanks for, for my wife. And with a wife like that, to have kids like this, uh, it's, it's, it's to have a, a Srin Sayu, a Mambuso, a Sona Aida, a Sona Bato. I'm here since like forever, but it's in battle. Mm. Because of you, because of your grace, your mercy, your tough, your nibble, your help. Uh, you keep putting the yeast on the hotel. You're giving me the yeast. Keep going, keep going. He feel like he should be giving thanks for uh, for his for his health for everything for everything. I want to say the back. Universal Masiga Nek, who you chanted the Muntu Mata. He said he was sitting over there, and uh, Universal Masiga said, uh, whoever has uh, words of thankfulness, you know, he can get up and say, Yeah. Oh, wow. Mondal, the Mofe, the Mofe Dugu, she niggled the Sibetu. He said he has arrived here in the U.S. after the under the niggle of city bed. Sibetu, the Mofe, the Mademba, Nakano Bordeaux, Manek Nis, Ragal Posian, and Nakhni Mai Sonia Kinokne. He said, uh, Serene Becho was in Bordeaux and he was in Nice, in France, and he was afraid to go and do his yard to Serene Becho because uh, Serene Becho was urging him about his uh, arrival here in the U.S. Uh -huh. He said, Nigel before was like going to help him and stuff like that. It was like something that was hard for us to do. He said, but the legal of coming here to the U.S. 
and the way said that you was urging them to hurry up and get here in the, in this country. He said in 2007 he obtained his uh, degree in, uh, in, in, in finance. Yeah. He was in France for 14 years. And you came to France with your tofer and everything you did for him over there. He said he never put in practice what he learned in school over there. Uh, since he's been here he said what you did for him is you had someone that was here already uh, basically taking care of him and doing everything that he was supposed to be doing he said he never went looking for a job. But right now he's the one that's searching for jobs for other people here in the country. Yeah, you said some of them. I'm Bokam Dako, best son of the new woman, Kim Mohawahe. Nakumon such a big boy, he says a lot of the lead, but he's sitting by. He said nowadays he's finding jobs for people and he hasn't even been here for that long. He said he's an uh, accountant, <laughs> Asian, wherever he's working. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And we all know that his English is not all of that. Mm -hmm. That's the Kena Kemano Sima. One accept person, American Yoguru Uzulu. He said he was look, he he was looking for a job with seven other people. Mm -hmm. In the mercy of some either. That same day. Mm -hmm. That same day he went looking for a job. That mm -hmm. same day he got a call back mm -hmm. from that company. Like approving that he obtained the job. Mm -hmm. He's giving thanks for the Mokotalibe that Sangibe has chosen for him. He said he's giving thanks for his wife, you know, that wow. sitting better head. She is not there today, but she, she, she's about to come. She's not here today, but she's preparing <laughs> to come visit Sunday. <laughs> he already get our tickets. He already bought his ticket. Uh -huh. And we are coming. <laughs> Receive <laughs> 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 about everything, uh, but also giving thanks. Giving thanks to Sidney Beto, which is sitting here right now. Uh, you know, like, you know, Universal Abdullah has said, we don't even have the words to express the way we really feel, you know, for Sidney, for, for, for you, Sidney. Um, 
We look around, everything we see, each on every, in every angle, we see something that we should be giving thanks for. Like, from being a Tali Bell sitting bedroom, still being here right now. You know, everything we have, our family, you know, I'm gonna start by, by you know, with my wife. You know, my Taliban first, because my Taliban is more important than everything. My relationship between city and Dutch. Uh, the, the way I've been feeling my love increasing for city and uh, I want to work for city and Dutch now more, even more than, <laughs> even, and more, even more than I was before. I feel like my love is for you, Sangabi, is increasing every day. And it's certainly better that did that. Uh-huh. You know, I, I can't even look at you, like, because of how I feel about you. Uh, I know that if you was asking for, you know, for soul, like for, for us to go die out, nobody gonna be in front. I'm gonna be, I make sure I'll be in the front. Uh-huh. You know, I just here we don't fight. It's just, uh-huh. it's just, it's just a way of me express, expressing that I, I'm, I'm not gonna be, I'm not gonna be behind when it comes to giving thanks to you. Okay. I'm always gonna be making sure that I'm, that I'm in here in the, you know, participating for whatever you want want us to participate for. I'm gonna be here and keeping on increasing my love, showing my happiness, uh, showing my gratitude, expressing expressing it in, in, in which and whatever way I can express it. You know, I'm gonna try my best to just, you know, increase my time because I feel like you've done everything for me. Everything. Every day I increase in ham ham, in knowledge. I increase in love. I make sure, you know, I feel like I'm increasing in each and every niggle of sin. The way I go about each and every niggle that you give, the way I pay attention now to sin, to the chance today, I, I wasn't I wasn't paying attention the same way. Before. I'm more I'm more conscious right now than before. And all of that is because of you, son. Um. If I know that if I wasn't here with you, if I wasn't in the yes, I wouldn't be going the way I'm going right now about city pressure. I would have been left behind. I would have been somewhere else doing something else. But you look at me, you know I'm giving thanks. Right. And I'm always going to make sure that I'm going to keep giving thanks. I give thanks, yeah. I give thanks uh, for, you know, about my wife, Mamu Sofala, which St. Ledger has given me, you know, in, in 2018. Really, like, the way she's following me. The way he's, she's obeying in each and everything I say. She's following my lead with respect. Everything I want is what it is. What I don't want, she, she you know, she don't, she not gonna put her mind in it. I feel like uh, Saint Betcha has made me a real king by just giving me a wife like that. And I has, I have to be thankful because you, know, you did it, Saint You did it. I could be here. I could be standing here talking to. The next day, yep. for what you've done for me, and I'm not gonna be done. <laughs> you know, I've never thought about having the children. I have sitting Salim, and I have Sohna Ed Salim in the house. Oh, huh? <laughs> that's, that's, that's really big. Like, the day you, the, the day y'all got the name of naming my my daughter after Sohna Ed Salim. 
That was that was really like a big one of the biggest days in my life to have the sauna at the in my house. Cause you, I think you know that I have a lot of love for you, uh, and I'm and I just I'm just praying for you for you to just keep me here. I don't want to go nowhere. I don't want to go anywhere. I have no business in, in anywhere else. I want to be here forever. I want to be with you, so I'm going to be forever. I'm only seeing you, I'm only li looking at you, and I'm only listening to you. I'm deaf about anything else. I'm only listening to you. Whatever you say is what it is. Whatever you want is what it is. I don't, I don't, I don't doubt. I don't hesitate. When it comes to working for Sitting Dutch, I don't do none of that. And I have to be thankful for that. I don't think when it comes to Sitting Dutch. Mm -hmm. I feel like I've, I've, given, I've given him my mind, my heart, and, and everything that I have. Hands, legs, everything is what belongs to Sitting Dutch. And I'm praying to stay that way with you for life. Mm -hmm. And in the afterlife. I want to be with you, son. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, while I was working in the government, I was asking Sonny Pecho to please give me a, a wife that loves you with Taliban. And Sonny Pecho said, that's easy for me. <laughs> that that's easy for me. And he said, I'll give you a wife before you go back to the United States. Okay. I said, Jero Jeff Chung. Jero Jeff. And time passed. Two weeks. Three weeks. Until it was time for me to get ready to go. And I, I didn't see <laughs> no wife. No wife yet. No, I was still single. <laughs> But, but I know Surin Becho. I had faith in Surin Becho. Because whatever he says will happen. So we prepare to get ready to go back to the to, to, to United States. My flight was going to be, I think it was like three days, you know, before I was to fly out to go back to the United States. And people were telling me, I, I think Swin Becho has left, you know, I was asking, you know, they think he's gone, left, the, you know, going somewhere. <clears throat> and I was like, I didn't know how this was going to happen. But he, I remember, I would always remember what he told me, that he was going to find me a wife. So before I was leaving, I got back to uh, Dakar. We were going to Dakar so I could get ready to fly back to the United States. And at the ZR, there was a, somebody told me there was going to be a ZR there in Juro. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I was there. And uh, we looked, we didn't know about it. We looked, like I was with the uh, Mok Talibay at that time. We looked at each other and we were like, ah, Juro Jeff Chun. <laughs> we said, we have to go to that ZR. <laughs> so we, I put on my boo boo. <laughs> And went to the ziar, and I remember crawling up to the sheikh to make my ziar, and I made my ziar, and I didn't say anything about a wife, nothing, because I know what Serene Becho told me, and I did my ziar, and right before I was getting ready to leave, Serene Becho said, "Ah." We, you still have to give you a wife. He said, Toggle, Toggle Fee. So I said, on the side, you know, and uh, they were, and the Sheikh and Sri Beto was telling everybody to go, go, find, go find a wife. Go find a wife. And, uh, and, and before, he knew, before I knew it, they had brought Denar out in front of me. <laughs> Looking very beautiful as I was. Wow. <laughs> With all
all white on. It was, she was very beautiful. And the Sheikh Sunni Beto looked at me, and he asked me like, like, what do you, what do you think? <laughs> I said, Jeru <laughs> Jeru you know, he, and so he laughed. <laughs> he laughed. And uh, he married us. But I'm giving thanks for all of this and the things he did for me that day. He married me, gave me a wife. He gave me his boo boo, he gave me his driver, put me in a car gave me money to give to her, 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 her father. Okay. Told, uh, told the driver to, to take him to Luga to give the money to her father. We drove all the way to Luga that night. And we gave that money to her father. And uh, we, we, we told her father that we were from we came from Surin Becho and what Surin Becho had done. And I remember the look on her father's face. <laughs> her father knew Surin Becho. Her father knew Surin Becho and kept talking about Surin Tuba and the work that Surin Becho meant to all of the Muris on this path. And he started crying. And, 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 and he knew exactly uh, what, what this was. And uh, later, you know, Sunni Bacho himself called her father and talked to her father about the marriage. And her father promised to do the marriage because he said he knows uh, he, he knows about Surin Bejo and how much he loves Surin Bejo. And this was right before uh, this was right before uh, Ramadan. And he said, after Ramadan, we'll do the marriage. And her right before the, the Ramadan, her father had passed. So the mercy that Srin Becho had the opportunity to give her father right before he passed is a blessing. Mm -hmm. And something to be very thankful for. And Surin, she made a ziyar to Srin Becho. And she didn't say anything about her father in the ziyar. And as soon as she came to make her ziyar, Sun Bento said, ah, your father, he's giving thanks with Surin Sai. Give thanks. So I'm, I, I, I just had to say that. I couldn't sit here and not say nothing. He has accepted what he said to what has done. Mm. He showed me my father in the, in the white house, the white room, with gold to the top, and they were cooking corn. They were cooking lamb like they were.